Ooh, yes, shipwreck. There has to be treasure in here. Yes. All right, now let's see where the treasure's at. Oh, yeah, the, the, there's like at least two treasure maps here. Oh boy. All right, it's right about here. Bang. Yes. What do we have? Oh boy, that is super. Totem of Undying. Bed rock. And now we have... <laughs> With a knockback. Whatever number that is. Hey, chicken. Be gone. <laughs> what? Pause. This is Minecraft, but treasure is super. Not only that there is going to be a lot of interesting treasure in this video, but the treasure is going to get crazier and crazier as the video goes on. Will I be able to beat the game by finding the most super treasure chests? Watch to find out. Also, a small percentage of viewers who watch this video are actually subscribed. So be sure to subscribe and like the video so we could beat the YouTube algorithm. Oh yeah, and one last thing. I haven't mentioned this in any of my videos, but I now have a PO box. So if you want to send me stuff, feel free to send it using the address in the description and i'll probably do a p.o box opening live on twitch enjoy the video and i hope you have a great day three two one let's do this our journey begins now of course we're just gonna go and get some quick wood and some stone all right there you go we got some stone tools oh wait hello uh looks like we found a, a dark purple square nice what's in here oh things yonk yonk okay but seriously based off of the things that you've seen from the intro we're gonna have to go and get a treasure map oh boy and usually these treasure maps are found from shipwrecks and unfortunately it would honestly take some time for us to go and find a boat but luckily there is a custom craft in order for us to go and make maps like the maps for us to go and find treasure and in order for us to go and get the ingredients we're gonna have to need this sugar cane bah. i'm on a boat and i see more sugar cane right there yeah, let's just get more of this sugar cane right here. We have 10 sugar cane. The nice thing about the sugar cane is that we could go and make a farm. But before we go and make a farm, let's go and make a map. Now, in order for us to go and make a map is this. Convert it into paper and then do this. A paper cube thing. In order for us to go and make this. um, The shiny paper. Oh, boy. OP treasure map. Drop to activate. This is drop to activate. So I'll just drop it. Oh, oh. Um, hello. What's this? Oh my god! Ew! Look how many X's there are. X, 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 X. <laughs> That's so ridiculous looking. Oh god. Okay, there's uh, just a bit of treasure in this map. Let's just go to one of these many X's on the map. Oh my god. I have to just approximate with my brain power. Okay, I'm assuming it's like down here maybe. Oh gosh, hello. Oh, oh there's a chest right here. Yes. What's in here? Oh, it seems like there's just not so many OP items in here. In fact, I don't think there's any OP items here at all. There's rotten flesh, poisonous potato, wither rose, jungle button. Like, what is this? This is horrible. Oh, wait. It seems like there's something at the bottom of my screen. It says level one. Oh, boy. It seems like the more we open these chests, the better the items will become. We're gonna have to go on a treasure hunt today, aren't we? It's not just one chest, not just this little chest, but we're gonna go on a treasure journey. Also, we could take some of the sugar cane and also paper because that would be very nice for us. All right, let's go to another one. Oh my gosh. I, it's really hard for me to see like where to go exactly because there's just so many X's in the way. It's just hard for me to see where I'm even at. Okay, I'm gonna mine down here. Hope for the best. Where's the chest? Come on, where is it? Oh, hello. More poop. Woo. Yay, poppies and granite. Ugh. It seems that the more we open the treasure chest and more items that we reveal, it gets us closer to upgrading to the next level. Come on, let's get one more so then we don't have to get these poop items. I've hit my daily quota of poisonous potatoes, man. Come on. Oh, number three. Bang. Oh, oh. Uh, congratulations, you have reached level two. Thanks, game. Thank you. Uh, what do we have? Oh, it's still level one treasure. Okay, okay, okay. We just need to find one more treasure chest, and then we're gonna get level two items. And I really wonder what it's going to be. Hopefully, it's not rotten flesh. Please, I don't want rotten flesh, all right? It's too smelly. Let's just go down here real quick. Let's just go down, see what we get. Oh, my shovel is GG. Oh, yes! Bang! 
Slightly less poop. Yes, an actual food. What a nice day to look at a loaf, huh? We also get shears. Pain mill armor. Really good. And a efficiency stone shovel. Really good as well. We got a shield so we could be protected. Okay, this is slightly slightly better stuff. All right, nice, nice, nice. I'm very satisfied with this. I'm very glad that we have like a shovel that has efficiency. That is so, so good. We could go down here as well. There's also ones that are like under an ocean or whatever. So we could honestly just do this and then mine down, mine down again, place that, break the water, and then. Oh my god! That was perfect! Oh my goodness. Oh, we got a bucket. Our things are looking a lot better now. We got books as well. Books are going to be really good if we're going to go and enchant. Oh, we got string as well, which is a material that we could use to make a bow eventually if we just keep opening treasure with string. Very nice. We got another string, yes. Let's just go and use our uh, crafting table. And then we're going to go and place two string right here to make a fishing rod. Now that we have a fishing rod, we could go and fish for a really nice item. Now, if you didn't know, if you use a fishing rod, there is a chance for you to go. Oh, hey, dog. I have my bones. Yes. I'm going to call you Bob. Hey, Bob. All right, come here, Bob. Let me show you this, this fishing rod thing. Anyways, the nice thing about having a fishing rod is that there's actually a chance for you to go and get a bow with enchants on it. Like, really, really good enchants on it. Now, unfortunately, we have to be lucky to get this type of bow. So, this might take some time. But since we have our little bob that is going to protect us while we're going to go fish, we'll be fine. And now, it's time for a fishing moment. Treasure edition. Boots? I have boots. Timberlands, dude. I'm going to go fish some more. Oh, my gosh. I, I broke the rod. And we have... Uh, a bit of fish just a bit of puffer fish as well yay i guess these bows are a lot rarer than i expected i mean i could go for another rod you know maybe nah i'm not gonna go for another rod and just sit there and just fish you know um <clears throat> Uh, maybe that second rod wasn't worth my time. Um, look how much junk I have. Like, what is all of this? Ew. Oh, and I have so much fish for food. I guess I'm gonna have to be eating sushi for dinner and breakfast and lunch. Oh boy. I have almost a stack of cooked cod. Oh man. And I got no bow. All I have is this scuffed bow that I have here. Man, let's just get more treasure chest, shall we? Woo. Nice. One more. Aha! Bang! Level three! Oh my goodness. Oh, we could get better items now. Thank goodness. Let's just go find one more treasure and then we'll see what new items are available for us. Uh, looks like there's one right here, maybe. Hello, any chests? Oh, nice. Moment of truth. This is what we're gonna get with level three loot in three, two, one. <gasps> Uh, spongebob oh we got iron that's really good and obsidian that's so so good also we got a trident interesting oh we've upgraded our armor as well the last level we had chainmail, but we could go and upgrade to iron armor which is usually the standard that we have for these videos so uh nice and there's a jukebox i'll take that i guess these items are like really good but also really weird at the same time so i don't mind this this is nice oh we got fire res that's really good if we have to go to the nether soon let me just yoink that real quick very nice oh yeah and one more thing i think we should probably go and like make another thing of a treasure map because i've kind of went around this whole entire area and i'm getting kind of confused which x's i've actually like looted and which x's i haven't so in order for us to go and like be less confused we should probably run to like a different part of the map and just load up a new map Map that we could just go and explore which is gonna be pretty nice for us yes anyways i think there's more stuff towards like this desert so we're just gonna loot this area real quick and then we're gonna go to like a new map low treasure low tre treasure more oh this is getting weird wait there's discs as well uh oh we got a very interesting disc oh, we get cake nice i guess as well oh we have spawn eggs as well we have turtle and cow which is cool mm, birth nice oh my gosh strength potion wow okay you might be wondering oh what are you gonna do with that jukebox tapple this mm, bang yeah Woo! 
That was really accurate. Very nice. You know, it might be weird that we have sponges in our inventory, but it actually is pretty helpful considering that we're trying to find treasure. And sometimes the treasure will be like on the seafloor. And that might be annoying for us to go and like try to like mine around underwater, you know? Let me just go make a new map real quick. Oh, and there's a new map. Okay. Hello. All right. Anyways, let's say I wanted to go all the way over here, like into this ocean area. I'm using my boat. And then we wanted to go down a bit. We could just use a sponge. Oh, and it removes all the water blocks. So then we're good. And then we could mine down here and get some treasure. Nice. Uncraftable tipped arrow. I guess this could work. Oh, yeah. Also, I feel like eating cake right now. Nom, 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 nom. Nice. This is a really weird situation. I'm literally underground in my own little cave eating cake. What is happening today? No. Woo! More. Wait, I just realized something. I just realized something. The higher the level of the loot, the better the items that would allow us to go and find more treasure much easier. We went from like stone shovel with efficiency one to like an iron shovel with efficiency two, which is faster for us to go and mine things, which is really nice i'm starting to like this trend let's get more shovels shall we i want to eventually get enough iron for us to go and make an anvil so then we could go and combine these shovels together to get like i don't know efficiency four that would be pretty nice yeah let me just hold these other shovels i think that would be really good for us yes we're getting more iron by the way if we get 31 iron ingots then we're gonna be able to go and make an anvil hopefully we could do that soon and since we fished for like an hour straight in real life by the way not in game we have 20 levels and we could use those levels to combine our shovels progress us. We're almost at level four. Come on. All right, reroll. Come on. Give us a new map. And we get. Oh. Oh, boy. So I've been opening up some treasure chests and uh, we're at 651 out of 690. We're almost there for level four. We're about to upgrade soon. Okay, okay, okay. We need to get like maybe like two or three more. Also, we're at 26 iron ingots, by the way. We just need a little bit more iron for us to go and get an anvil. Hopefully we get it soon. I mean, honestly, I could, I could just go and take this iron real quick and just smelt it so we could get the anvil. Bang, bang. And we could go and make an anvil just like this. Ta -da. Now we can go like boom, 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 boom. And ah, we need 12 levels. Is that at least fast? It's faster than before. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're only at six levels. We need a little bit more levels to get efficiency for unless, unless, of course, we go and fish, you know, just kidding. I'm never going to put myself through that ever again. Nope. Oh, we're so fast. Oh, my gosh. We could like giga drill now. We could just go like brrr. the anvil is a very good choice. A very good investment. Yes. I am satisfied. Holy crap. I think if we just keep mining treasure that's basically around dirt, then it would allow us to easily find it. Also, oh, hello. It seems like there's another obsidian square right here. Hello, obsidian square. Things. Oh, it's like right here or something, man. I right, sponge the area. Let me go and find the treasure, please. Come on. Where is it? Oh, it's right here. Oh, my goodness. Are you serious? We just looked at level four treasure. Oh, my goodness. Also, it takes 1,500 items to go and get level five. And keep in mind, level five is actually going to be the maximum level. So uh, we just need to upgrade one more time. Oh, yeah. This is the second best loot. It's starting to get kind of OP. I mean, we have diamonds already. Beak in. Bottles of enchanting. Very good for the anvil. Oh, my gosh. We have efficiency for diamond shovel. Well, that was very quick and easy to replace. Yay. Thanks, game. And we also have fireworks, which I'm pretty sure is going to be helpful in the future. So I'm going to take that. We have a shulker box. Okay, shulker. And of course, an enchanting table. So good. Now, keep in mind, this isn't the, the highest level that we're in. We're only in level four. We haven't even got to level five yet. Imagine the items that we're going to have when we're at level five. Oh, boy. But luckily, I could just go on like a lawnmower my way to like all the treasure because this shovel is just so nice. We could just go like and we could find treasure easy peasy. Yes. Thank you. Oh, we get books as well and golden apples. Okay. Our food is really, really nice right now. Oh, wow. We got an anvil. Yay. Love how we grind so hard on level three, getting just that one item, aka the anvil, just so we could just upgrade to level four and just get the anvil easy peasy. Like, bruh. Oh my God. Wait, it gives us diamond armor as well. It's just getting much, much better. We have TNT as well. This is actually a really good block to use when we have to go clear out blocks, especially since we're trying to like excavate for, you know, 
treasure. This is gonna allow us to go and find stuff faster. Very nice. We also have lapis. Very nice. That's a great addition to the loot that we have. Also, I should probably go and put like stuff in the shulker box because I'm starting to clutter up like my inventory with just random things. <laughs> Excavate! Excavate! Ooh! Ooh. And we got more diamonds. Very good. I realized I could replace this iron pickaxe. Yeah. With like a diamond pickaxe now. Yes. I mean, pickaxe. Boom. And of course, we could go and add efficiency with it because we have an efficiency book. Oh, yeah. Our tools are looking a lot better. It's slowly just getting better and better and better for our armor and weapons. Brr. Oh, my gosh. That was so fast. <gasps> Pink shulker box. Nice. Oh, we got a chest plate as well. That's two pieces out of four. We are half diamond now. Let's keep going. All right. I'm feeling fancy right now. I'm going to go and place some TNT right here. Let's go find some treasure, shall we? Treasure with style. Oh, Ooh. where is it? I think it's like right here. Bang. Yes. Oh my God. It's just getting better. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It's stacking up. We're three forts. All we need is just diamond boots. Oh, we could go get the boots later. Let's just go and get an axe right now. Yes. So good. Oh, it's right here. Bang. Woo. Oh my God. Flame. We're going to get a flame bow. Yes. I'm going to go and make a bow right now. This is a great time to do it. And then we're going to place an anvil just like so. And then we're going to put flame on this bow to get flame one. And then we could go and cook our meat. Nice. You know, not that I shot that chicken. It seems like things are getting a lot better now, huh? The character development is real. Let's keep going. Oh, I got diamond boots and luck of the sea. Finally. Wait a minute. What if I could just go and attempt to redeem myself one last time? I have luck of the sea, dude. I'm going to go and make one more rod. Oh, I hope this gets us a bow. I really hope so. I hope this doesn't take 5 billion years for me to go and get, I don't know, a power tube bow or something, man. I hope I get something really nice soon. All right, I'm going to go and make some sticks. Here's the rod. And now we're going to go and add our luck of the sea. Let's just hope for the best now. I'm going to go fishing right here. Here we go. I believe. Oh my gosh. That was worse than the first rod. I've been scammed by a high degree. Oh boy. Even that one wasn't worth it. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Yes. Oh my goodness. Oh, come on. We're almost there. We're almost there. I've been grinding this level four for like so long already, man. We're 1,389 out of 1,500. We're almost there. Oh, come on. One more. One more. 1,490. Come on, last one. Where are you? Please be around. Please. Oh, oh, Max, Max. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's been so long. I've never looked at the word max and just felt so satisfied. Holy crap. Now that we've unlocked level five, let's just go over here real quick. Hold on. Let's get another treasure right here. Hold on. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness. This is it. This is it. All right. This is it. Level five. This is going to be the most OP loot that we're going to have for this video. All right. The moment of truth. Level five, maximum level loot in three, two, one. Bang. Oh, that's a lot of another. That's a lot of diamonds as well. Oh my God. Look at the knockback. Six, nine, six, nine, six, nine, six, nine. Knockback. Yes. Dude, I'm going to replace all of this loot right now. Goodbye, diamond pickaxe. We got netherite armor as well. Oh my goodness. End crystal spawner. Oh, we have a whole lot of stuff here. Oh my gosh. Enchanted books with level 69 as well. That is amazing. I am half netherite from this one chest. Let's take these netherite ingots as well. Holy crust. Oh my gosh, the netherite pickaxe is so satisfying. Yes, dude, we can mine the stones like it's nothing, like it's dirt, which is pretty much nothing in my book. Ooh. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of... We got three totems, enchanted golden apple, and the boots. Oh, the boots. Bedrock. Okay, thank you, game. This is such a nice way for us to go and find, like, the chests, man. Thank goodness. <laughs> it's amazing. This is absolutely blissful. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad we kept the fireworks as well because now we could use an elytra and just go anywhere we want to. So good. Oh yeah. Also with our netherite hoe, we should probably go and test something real quick. Is that a polar bear right there? Hey, polar bear. Okay. I'm going to put on my elytra and just, I'm, I'm just going to fly real quick. 
All right. Hey, polar bear, what up? How you doing? What's up, man? Are we friends, huh? Polar bear, can we high five? High five. <laughs> Oh my god! I think I hit the polar bear from the North Pole all the way to the South Pole. Oh boy. Well, at least we know it works. That's very nice. I'm glad to say that I think the netherite <laughs> works just, just pretty well. Please, treasure chest. Where's the treasure chest? There's the treasure chest. Hello. More things. Oh, punch as well! We can get punch, yes! Oh, gold mania. <gasps> yes! This is the one that we wanted. The final... Peace! This is awesome. I mean, look at these enchantment levels. 69, 69, 69. Amazing. We found a sharpness book. I think we know what to do. Boom, boom, boom. Sharpness on the axe as well. So good. Honestly, I'm now satisfied with like our loot. I mean, we have full netherite. We got totems and fire res and a lot of gold, especially along with an elytra, TNT, and crystals. And of course, the best thing of all, Oh, I think we're done with the uh, treasure finding today. However, there are still a few things that we still need to find in order for us to complete this challenge. And it's to find the bastion and the fortress in the nether and then the stronghold to kill the dragon. Let's do this. But before that, I'm going to go and just add some, uh, some of this on the shovel. There you go. Now we are fully netherite. Nice. So yeah, we have our obsidian. Let's just place this right here. We are going to go and make a quick portal. Boom, boom. Let's get like some flint right here so we can make a flint and steel and like the portal. Bang. It's ready. And now it's time for us to go and enter. Oh boy. I'm going to start with my fire resistance. I'm going to also put on my elytra so then we could go and maneuver around really nicely around here. Oh boy. Okay. Our adventure in the nether starts now. Oh, wow. The ba the Bastion was just right here. Okay. Well, that was simple. Okay. Hey, Bastion. What up, Bastion people? Oh, boy. Uh, they're kind of mauled. Oh, God. I pissed them off. Oh, God. Ah! Hey, you. Please come here. Hello, everyone. Let's go and trade the gold now. Come on now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You too. You too. Give me pearls now. I need pearls so I can get Eyes of Ender. Come on now. Oh, spectral arrows. These spectral arrows are actually pretty nice. Yes, pearls. Thank you. Let's keep going with the pearls now. All right, let's get more pearls. Come on, come on, come on. More pearls. Dang it. While you guys give me pearls, I'm going to go and add something to my bow. I'm going to add... Uh, I'm going to add punch. Punch to my bow. Oh, nice. Yes, thank you. Thank you, game. That's enough trading. You can all perish now. Goodbye. Goodbye. I appreciate your efforts to helping me out. All right. Okay, I'm going to go now. Bye. Bye, Bastion. It seemed like I did such a positive, nice impact to that community right there. I'm such a nice Minecraft player. Also, there's the, the fortress with the blaze spawner right here. Hello. Don't mind me with my 23 minutes of fire resistance. Hello. Hello. Let's get blaze rods. Oh, my gosh. They're a one hit. Holy crust. Wait a minute, I have thorns. <laughs> hey, what up? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's horrible for them. Ah, ah. We have five rods now. Simple as that. Also, we could get rid of these pigmen because we're unstoppable. And that's the point of this video. We got seven blaze rods and now we could honestly leave. Really, like we could go. All right, I'm going to go and make my eyes of ender right now. Boom, boom. And now it's time for us to leave. I'm going to make the portal right here and we're just going to go. That was simple. And that is called a success. A huge success. Let's go. Okay. All right, we're here. Very cool. Very nice. Now we know the direction of the stronghold and we're going to have to go this way now. Oh, yeah. And the way we're going to go to the stronghold is with our wings. We're just going to majestically fly all the way to the stronghold. Why not? Ooh, okay. That's a that's a huge angle change. I feel like we're getting close. I feel like we're getting close, close. Did we pass it? Let's see. If it goes behind me, then we passed it. Oh my gosh, we've passed it. Okay, we're really close to the stronghold. That's a very good sign for us. Boop. It's like right here. Okay, according to my calculations, it's going to be pretty much right here. Yes! Okay. Very, very good. Also, there's like a temple right here, and I guess we could go and explore it real quick, I guess. Yes? I mean, we're OP. We don't really need this, but I mean, sure, why not? Yeah, rotten flesh. Very good. Now, this is what everyone in the comment section wanted this whole time. 
<laughs> just a bunch of rotten flesh. Ew. There you go, comment section. That's what's in the temple, if you're wondering. Okay, it's time for us to go mine down. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be the fastest we've ever mined down before. So, oh, oh, we're here. <laughs> the silverfish. Oh, we're in the stronghold. Hello, is there a portal nearby? Hello. Gee, I hope there's some hot portals around my area that I could go and meet. Here, lava, actually. Wait, hold on. Wait, it's like this direction. Yes, it was right here. Okay. <laughs> we cleared that so perfectly. We can go and fill this portal up. Now, the question is, are you ready to enter? And the answer is... Yes. Yes, we are. Let's do this. Oh, Elytra mode. Here we go. Finale moment. Here we go. Let's do this. Woo! Elytra plus bow combo. Bang! Let's go over here. Mind the obsidian and break that. Let's go to the other cage. Mind all the obsidian with our efficiency 69. Bang! Let's use our flame boat to shoot the dragon now. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I think it's perching. Oh, it's definitely perching. Oh! Yeah! Thorn 69! Yeah! Keep shooting! We're almost there! Almost there! It's so low. It's so low right now. I'm switching back to the Elytra. I'm gonna slam you! Come here! Yeah! <laughs> what? What was that? Oh my god! I became a human bullet! A human bullet to kill the dragon! Oh, oh my god. I think that was a new experience. <laughs> I didn't even know I could do that. I didn't know that was even possible. That was that was awesome. Now we could enter the portal with the egg. That is it. That is the journey. Started from the bottom and we came on top. Thanks for watching. That was really fun. I enjoyed that. I'll see you next video. Bye.